Good morning. Welcome to dot programming dot blogspot com. This is my blog. Uh, today I will show you how to design a online voting system project in ESP dot net C sharp. So first of all, select a Visual C sharp language in Visual Studio two thousand seventeen or earlier. You can use old Visual Studios like two thousand thirteen, two thousand twelve, two thousand ten also. So ASP.NET Web Form sites and change the name of the website is online voting system. Yeah, it's pretty simple and to make a new website and a new project uh, in Visual Studio. Visual Studio 2017 takes some additional features uh, related to entity frameworks and many more things. Uh, also updates in Visual uh, C Sharp. And uh, a new things come in the ASP.NET Core also. But uh, today, and making some series of uh, web forms, online voting system project. So this is the default folders, or directories, and files in Solution Explorer. So first to add a master page. In Visual Studio, so that is the first master page, or you can say the first layout of the page. You can add, you add it in Visual Studio. The name of the master page also change according you. Okay, now, now. This is the master page. You can also add a new style, or you can say style sheet. So first, to make a new directory in Solution Explorer or your project in your into your project, the style sheet is there. Now change the name of the style sheet is anything you want to. Put some name. You you are very familiar with the style sheet and the page class. I want to design a centralized web page using the page class. So in it here, with the width is 950 pixels. That is the standard pixels according to the HD, and you can say the simple resolution of the screen. And the margin is zero pixel from the top, and the auto from the right side, zero pixel from the bottom, and the left is automatically. Okay. Now, drag this file and drop it in the head section of the page. Yeah, it's too much simple. Now. Change the name of the page is, or you can say, change the name of the ti uh, title of the master page that is online voting system. Okay. Now, come into the body part. Actually, here we have uh, some divisions. Only one division that is in it. We have a content plus holder, so you can design your design or your layout of the page. So first to add a single division for the header part, and second for the content part, or you can say body of the page. Content part and the third division used for the footer part. Okay, that's pretty simple. Now in the content part, you can drag and drop the content plus folder. If you want to know about the content plus folder, actually content plus folder is a variable part. 
where your content display you can visit my channel and please subscribe my channel if you like this video and share it if you like it so now class is a page class that is the outer division actually here yeah oops is something wrong because there is no actually here zero pixel from the top right side is auto but left side is zero pixel so remove this is zero pixel actually from the bottom and the right left side is auto automatic so now the centralized web application page is there if you want to make some changes in the width section so change it here Twelve hundred pixel. Make wide application according to the FHD screen. Eighteen hundred and fifteen uh, hundred is also there. Okay. Now come to the header part and the footer part and the body part. Now in the header part, first to make a header section. in the footer section so that is the navigation part actually here where your navigation is display navigation part and this is the footer part in navigation part having with the some hyperlinks or you can take some navigation control like the menu control and the hyperlink control also is there so first to make a new uh, id section in the css file so the height is there uh, height is uh, 70 pixel and uh, the background color is nice blue is my favorite color you can uh, take any other color from the palette okay yeah it's a uh, facebook color is a my favorite color but the font color also change so first of all add a new menu control in place of the simple text from the toolbox use a toolbox menu control is not there hyperlink control actually is there menu control so menu drag and drop it here the default menu orientation is vertical so make some changes in orientation that is horizontal okay yeah also change their text uh, in the design time so that default text is new item so make some changes in the text property of the menu control menu item control actually customer login or the voter login you can put some text it here okay so uh, this is the simple scenario will give you and in the four color that is the white okay it's pretty simple uh, it's pretty looking good in the footer part you make some changes uh, like the copyright sign so in the source part in the division part m percent copy copy and put some uh, text it here like the voting system 2017 yeah now this is the design of the first page 
so thank you thank you very much for watching this video tutorial please keep watching my all other video tutorials which is related to online voting system and isp.net so thank you thank you very much